Hey YouTube, I'm going to make a quick video on how to add a toggle switch to your radio. That way you do not have to use your keys to turn on your head unit. Alright, so the first thing you're going to need to do is tear your shit up. Get access to your radio. Get these back cables exposed. And now what you're going to need is a voltmeter. Alright, so what you want to do is you want to turn on your voltmeter to DC. You want to make sure you have a good source of ground. There's my ground hooked up directly to ground. Uh, and now what we're going to do is flip the key on. I already found the wire. It's this purple one. Turn down the radio. Get copyrighted. And this purple one, as you can see, is producing 11, should be 12, but the battery's a little bit low. And now, let's see if I can leave this in here. Up here. There it is. So now, it's reading 11. There, power is off. Radio is off. Okay, reading back at 12. So that is our ignition switch to turn the radio on. Now what we gotta do is find a 12 volt. There it is, 12 volts. Turn off the car. Okay, radio's off. Still producing 12 volts. All right, so that's the wire we're gonna hook up. Now let me just show you what I mean. I just wanted to show that the keys are in. The radio's playing. We're gonna turn the key off. There's the keys. Now we're gonna use this little jumper. Sticking our 12. There it is, radio's kicking on. Radio's on. Turn up the volume. Talking about safety. See? Why? You guessed it. Safety. The key's not on there. I watch stations, fire protection. You name it. And that's how we jumped it. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna get our wire solder these wires together with our wire with this white one as well hook it up to the jumper and that's it and that's all you do to connect your radio so you can play it without a key sweet thank you for watching please like and subscribe don't forget to hit that bell all right let's get out of here before we get kicked out